Hey everybody, welcome back to Live Gaming Network. I'm GenX, and here today I'm going to show you how to create a Krunker mod so you can use any melee item in the game that you want. This technique will not only show you how to change the default weapon to any melee item, it will also show you how to use any skin that item has. If you like what you see in this video, don't forget to smash that like button and subscribe to the channel for future content. Also, I'm playing Krunker on Twitch Monday through Friday at 10 a.m. Eastern if you want to come hang out. All right, let's show you guys how to do this. All right, you guys, the first thing that you're going to do is go to livegamingnetwork.net slash downloads. The link is in the description below. Once you're there, click this guy right here. It will start your download on the top right. Depending on how fast your internet is, this might take a little bit of time. Once the file is done downloading, all you have to do is click show in folder right here and move your mod.zip to your desktop. Close everything out. Once you're on your desktop, go ahead and right click, go to new folder, name it new mod and move the mod zip into the folder. Open the folder, right click on the zip file and go to WinZip and extract to here. If you do not have WinZip, go to winzip.com. The link is in the description below. You can download a free demo. You could also use WinRAR. Depending on how fast your processor is, this might take a couple minutes. Once it is done, what you're going to do is delete both CSS folders, delete script and shaders, and if you're not gonna modify the sound of the melee, you can go ahead and delete sounds now. If you don't know how to mod sounds, go ahead and watch my How to Make a Conquer Mod Part 1 video from a month ago. I'm gonna go ahead and delete it, and open up textures, and delete everything except for the melee folder. Then go back and go into models and delete everything except for the melee folder. Now go back to textures. Now inside the melee folder, you will see that every single melee in the game is listed with a number. The default weapon is icon zero. And in this video, we're going to show you how to do a katana. In order to change the katana to the default weapon, everything has to be changed to icon zero. So we're gonna delete everything up here except for the katana and rename this to icon zero. Now in the game, it'll show the katana blade instead of the default weapon. Below you can choose which skin you would like. Remember that the katana was weapon number 10, so go down to weapon 10 and choose which one you want. As you can see, some melee items have two files, one with an E and one without an E. These are files that are animated or glowing. Unfortunately, default items in the game cannot glow or animate, so you will only need the first file, not the second file with the E. In this video, we're gonna take melee skin number five. So what you wanna do is delete everything in here except for the icon and the skin that you chose after that rename the skin so it's melee zero now go back to your new mod folder and go to models open up melee and at this time you have to change the default melee item that is melee zero with the katana object which is melee item number 10. So you wanna delete everything except for Melee 10 and then rename Melee 10 to Melee 0. Once you're done with that, then you can create your mod folder. Select both models and textures by holding control on the keyboard or you could just drag and create a box. Either way, once they are both selected, right click, go to WinZip and add to new mod.zip. Your mod is now ready to load in the game. You can open up Krunker. Once Krunker is open, make sure you are signed into your account. Click on Mods. Go to Upload Mod. Once you're in the hub, go ahead and select a thumbnail if you've created one. You don't have to create a thumbnail if you don't want. After that, click on Select to upload your mod. Go to your desktop, into your new mod folder, and select your newly created new mod.zip. Give it a nice name. Click Publish. 
depending on how large your mod is, it may take a couple seconds for the green check mark to pop up. Just be patient. Once it pops up, close the hub. And when you're back in your game, go ahead and click mods, go to my mods, find your newly created mod, click the play button, and the default combat knife should now be the katana in the game. As you can see, here's the katana with the skin that we chose. But that's it, you guys. It's as easy as that. If you use that technique, you can unlock any melee item and use any skin for that melee item. Don't forget to smash that like button and subscribe to the channel for future content. We'll see y'all next time. And remember, don't be toxic. Spread positivity.